How's it going everybody? If you have one of these little axles, this is a little utility trailer. And it has these little bearing covers. It's basically grease behind there. And this is a very old trailer. I probably had it 15 years. But this little rubber seal was starting to crack. And when you drive it, a little bit of grease would start to splatter out. As you see around the rim right there. <clears throat> that just means that this little seal is starting to degrade. Starting to crack open, if you see right there. And you can actually buy the entire little cover with a new seal. Not very expensive. And uh, it's actually not, not very difficult to remove either. I used a, a big, big pair of channel locks. And you just had to get a hold of it, you know, right there. And just pry it off. It'll come right off. Then the new one has this little, you know, this little seal right here. It just pops right in. It pops right in place, just like that. See from the other side there. Very, very simple. And then I just used a, a heavy plastic mallet, but you could use like a little two by four or a piece of wood. And you just basically, you know, just put it flush on there and just tap it in place, you know, with your piece of wood or a, a soft hammer or something like that. Just make sure you push it in, you know, very evenly and it'll go right in place just like the old one came out. No big deal at all. Let's see if we can do the other one real quick. All right, let's try the other side real quick. Like, like I said, just get you a big set of channel locks. Like that. Put them at the uh, widest setting. And just get a good grip on this and start prying on it. See it start to wiggle right out. A little bit of grease is up in there. That's what this is guarding actually is the grease inside. So you need to do this kind of quickly. Make sure you put your little rubber cover on there. Very easy, it just pops in place. Put this on as flush as you can. You know, make sure you can tell that it's on there nice and evenly and just put the hammer like this. And just tap gently. Just keep going gently. And you'll hear it when it's solid. When it sounds solid, that's on nice and good. That's all there is to it. Done in a matter of moments. Yeah, so it's just this little plug right here. You might be able to buy just that, this little rubber piece, but I didn't see it. So look for the link down below. I'll tell you where you can get this right here. These are, you know, probably about two inches, two inch diameter. And um, no big deal. But yeah, if you're starting to notice that it's starting to splatter around the rim every time you drive or, you know, tow the trailer, that's what's going on, but not a big deal at all. Bada bing, bada boom, finito. And that's it, so make sure you check out our other videos. We've got tons of stuff that'll help you out, and things, uh, fixing stuff around the house, and vehicles, and dirt bikes, and cars, and trucks, and whatnot. So check out our other videos. You'll find something that may help you. And Google Horsepower House, we're all over the internet. That's it for now. Biker Dave signing off. Have a good day.